First battle in Dynasty's Pearl, we head out left. We spot one person. They obviously went the wrong way. So we headed over there, put a shot to this guy, go in for the final kill, and ah, easy kill. With that done, I head back into the fighting. I spot the Tiger 1. Unfortunately, hit the track. First shot, bounce the next shot. Go ahead and up closer because I need to hit him. Hit the SU. It's his track. And uh, we head in. Ori is attacking. Break his track again, which is unfortunate. But it does give us enough time to put a shell into him. And get the reload to finish the job. Now this little AMX here is giving me a little bit of trouble, but I get the ram on him. Somehow I miss a shot from very close range, and I uh, see I'm in very much trouble if I stay there, so I back out and keep an eye on my six. Get a shot to the grave leader there as he is peeking. He's uh, focused on the object, but get an unfortunate track break on the tiger instead of actual damage, but it is still not over. I do not get the kill on the AMX because the object gets it. Uh, Grave Digger comes in, charging. I get a shot to him. Get enough time to reload, put another shot to him. I do not get the kill though. Now the Tiger 2 and the Tiger 1 are both pushing me and the object. They're focused on the object because he is uh, one shot, which means I get some plenty free shots on the Tiger 2. Now the Tiger 1's coming in close because he feels the heat coming in and he takes out the object. From this point on, it is just a matter of getting the shells into him. I get a lucky bounce there. Close range. Not a problem. I once again do not get the final blow, but we are now in position to win. Only one tank left. I'm almost full health. He has full health. 2v1. another shot into it, bounce a shot. This is pretty much over for this guy. Shoot him again, ram him, do not get the final blow, but it is a very good victory regardless of kills. And quite a bit of damage as you'll soon see. So we got a total of 3,507 damage and two eliminations. Could have got more eliminations, but as you can see, we uh, lost some kills there, which is all good. Team did decently well, top three, but the second battle is now in Port Bay. Head into this town, get a shot on this Tiger P. Very lucky shot. And we try to get a second shot, but we are unfortunately unable to do that. So we head deeper into town to get this Churchill 6, get a shot to him, reload, try to push him a little bit. I know there's a lot of enemies on the right. Unfortunately, we bounce him, and he bounces us. Now I see that the panther is coming in, which I need to uh, avoid. Get a shot to him. He sees me. I bounce his shot. And now I am facing the Churchill and the panther, which the Churchill manages to track me. And I get a shot to him. Now I go into side scrape mode, because I know that he cannot penetrate me from a side scrape. And I put another shot to him. bounces once more and hides behind the crates. So this time I go after the panther. Somehow I bounce a shot off his front. Uh, no clue how that happened. Run another shell into him as the Churchill bounces. He gets a shell into me. Not a problem. I have tons of health. But he, the Churchill, is uh, pushing me. And I see the T29. At this point I am in deep trouble because I cannot fight 3v1 and then the IS comes in. The KV1S. At this point, I realize it's 3 to 6, and we are in big trouble. I think I'm dead right now. Fortunately, my ammo gets hit, so I am in a bad position. Bounce up plenty of shots, though, which uh, is quite impressive. At this point, I am looking at my reload, hoping that it comes back. Put a shot into that guy. Doesn't kill him, unfortunately. And at this point, I am just waiting for my repair to reload. It's got less than 10 seconds on it got the ARL and unfortunately I do a track hit on this AMX. Would have been an easy kill otherwise. So now with my ammo repaired I can now face this T29 that is flanking. The 
a shot into him, side scrape as best as possible, he bounces a shot, I put another one into him. Now I know that I can tank at least one shot from this guy, so I am just playing it as aggressive as possible. Unfortunately I track him there, but it doesn't make him miss his shot. And from this point on, he is charging, I know that I'm going to have to just put as many shots as I can into him until he kills me, but he bounces a shot, put a shot into him. And I know at this point, we have a good chance of beating him, especially if he bounces a shot, which we don't have to because he takes a shot at, I think it's the ARL, no, it's the VK. So we get the kill on the T29, and now we just have to fight the Churchill 6, which is a lower tier than I am, tier 6, so it should be an easy finish. I was not expecting this win at all, so we just put one last shell into him, as he bounces me. Very impressive game. I was very surprised to have finished it out without losing. So as you can see, we got 4,330 damage with two kills. Got a mastery. Only one player got 1,000 damage. The rest of them got pretty poorly, but we managed to do the carry. I want to thank my members, Convoy175, a random stickman, and the giant slug for supporting the channel.